Hey everyone, um, welcome to my channel. Thank you for looking at this video. Um, if at the end of it you like it, please feel free to subscribe, like, and share. Sharing's good, it's good to share. Um, this um, is not a tutorial as such, it's just a little bit of info uh, regarding your iPhone. Um, what you're seeing on screen is my iPhone. and. What I didn't know until very recently is that you have a, an app that ships with your iPhone. It's part of it. You can't actually get rid of it. Um, called Health. And here it is on mine. I, I just moved it off the home screen. and didn't like the look of it. And it's one of these ones that iPhone ship, Apple ship. You can't get rid of it. So if you try and delete it, you, you have no option there. It, it's You're stuck with it. Never looked at it much before. But actually, it's it's a, it's a functioning little little tool. Um, here you go, it measures my um, um, daily steps and all, all, all kind of that. Uh, so, that uh, so it acts a bit like a, a pedometer, I suppose. Um, it, it does all sorts, but the, the most important part of this little app here, for me anyway, is this one here on the bottom right hand side. It's called Medical ID. Now, we're going to create. A, we'll create the medical ID first, and I'll show you how we access it. And and essentially, if we hit create medical ID, this button here is the most important one. Show when locked. Um, if you've not got it activated, show when locked, then there's prob possibly not much um, point in doing this. But oh, surprise! It's put my date of birth in already. So. It's asking me who is this? It's me. I can edit it. I can put another details if I want, but you know that's fine. It's my name, date of birth, and medical conditions. Now you can add one or many. So so let let's add a, a few, in. and and I'm going to put just um, some fictitious ones. I don't suffer for these, and and I'm just putting them in for the sake of adding something. And um, apologies if uh, somebody looks at this and they have one of these conditions uh, it's really just a you know it, it's a look um it's so that people can can see how how to use it so let, let's say i've got um uh, uh diabetes I've got diabetes uh what else could i have i could have a uh, heart condition heart condition um, what else could we have heart condition Let, let's say I have a, um, diabetes Let, let's put in controlled by insulin uh, let's say it's type 1 diabetes And I'm not going to put lots and lots in here, but the, 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 you, you get the idea. So you can put a few about control by insulin, heart condition, uh, let's see what kind of medication, uh, a GTN spray, people who, um, paint capitals, GTN spray. And we'll close that off there. Okay, so there's there's just a couple in there heart condition. What we might I even go in. Um, I'm, I'm trying to think some heart conditions I could put in. You could put anything you want in regarding your own medical condition. I don't have these, so I'm not really sure too much about the, the terminology. But um, let's just say um, you've got um, heart condition. Con heart condition which when heart condition when attacks happen GTN spray relieves is that how you spell relieves? Um, Symptoms, okay. Um, diabetes. 
Expedites Insulin and check self add self administered daily. Okay, um, okay, so let's go on the allergies now. Common allergies, sorry, food allergies, nuts. And I said I'm not going to put lots in there, but you, you could put various things. Um, I don't know the correct spelling, so I'm going to say it how I sound it phonetically just EpiPen, EpiPen, and car. And in locker. So just say this happens when I'm at work. Um, I got some things. Now this is the next one, which is a good one. Add an emergency contact. My wife has a, a few. So let's just say the wife, and she has three phone numbers in, in here. So if I go into the wife, I can add in, say, her mobile. Put it in spouse. And then I can add another emergency contact. And it's the wife. So that was the mobile. So this is uh, the works one. Works mobile. Because we're going to get our own name. And let's just put one more in. Add an emergency contact. The wife. Um, works mobile. Let's just put our works office number in. So so there's me got um, that in there. Um, blood type, I'm O. O positive. Uh, organ donor, uh, yes please. And uh, add weight. Do you really want me to add weight? Okay, let's just make an imaginary weight of say 60 kilos. Let's put a 94 kilos. Let's be a bit more honest. And as high, um, it's in centimetres. I can't do centimetres. So we'll just leave the centimetres out. We'll take that out. Delete the height. And like, done. So there we've got some useful information on the phone. Um, should I have some kind of collapse? Now, these may be completely irrelevant. Let's hit edit one more. Um, and let's just add on. Uh, medical condition, medical notes. Um, let's just say contact the wife. Wife ASAP for for their DTs, details. I'm just put a wee bracket in there, separate that. Sometimes I'd be blah, blah, blah. okay. So so that's done now. Now, how is that of any use to anybody? Well, I'm going to go back to our our home screen here, and when this locks, my screen might go blank for a minute. So we're we're back on my home screen on my phone. Now this is locked. Um, so paramedic comes, finds you, knows you've got an iPhone, and quickly does this. And he's not going to dial 999 at this point. What he's going to do is press the emergency button here. And on the next screen, you come to this. And that's all the information that we just put in the phone a few minutes ago. Um, it doesn't have to unlock your phone. doesn't need to do anything. You can quickly phone the wife. You know, tell her you're not going to be in for tea because you've had a heart attack. Um, you know, it, it, it's, 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 it's a fantastic little app that's inbuilt in your phone and if you take five minutes to fill it in it could be the difference between you getting the proper treatment or not so hopefully you all have this filled in um, the, the one thing that, that you have to be aware of though is once whatever information you put into the screen will be available to anybody who gets their hands on your phone um, and, and that, that maybe be something that you're not gonna so, so maybe you don't want to put too much in there um, but but the the notes in here contact the way fast up for further details heart condition 
possibly be enough. You might not want to put in all your all your medical notes in there, but yeah, there you go. That's another little iPhone tip. Hopefully it helps someday. Bye!